guys welcome back to my channel it's me mystic beauty and i'm here to do your energy reading for the sign of cancer i hope all of you guys are doing well i hope all of you guys are doing well um so also um some things have changed um two for 20s will no longer be friday and sundays two for 20s will be um monday wednesdays and fridays so if that's something that you guys are interested in um be sure you guys come out and hang with me okay so spirit what messages do you have for the sign of cancer what's going on with the person that they are dealing with how what is this person's headspace what is this person's headspace Okay, so right off the bat, um, I feel like either you have told the truth of a situation or you feel like that um, there's some truth that needs to be said in some type of situation. Um, I have time to go here. So this really could be what you're saying to somebody that you're leaving them or you no longer want to be in this connection anymore. Um, I have the blessed card. Someone feels as though that um, things will just pan out better for them. If they um, move forward, you know, this is a soulmate. This is definitely a soulmate that you're dealing with. Um, this person could have disappeared on you or this person just could be distant altogether. I feel as though you tried to be flexible with this person. Um, either you watch this person from a distance or this person watched you from a distance. But time is definitely running out on this person in this situation altogether. Um, I really feel like this person just really took too long. This person took too long to express a love emotion with you. And with the time to go card here and new life being here, um, someone is deciding that they're, they're wanting new life. Someone no longer wants to wait on someone to, um, to choose them. I feel as though you try to be flexible with with this person, with your soulmate. Um, you're looking for your good fortune at this time. You're, you know, you're looking for your blessing. And this could be some truth that you're telling this person, or this could be some truth that your person is telling you. So we're just gonna go ahead and clarify some cards and just to see, you know exactly you know what is going on especially with this observer card being here um this person possibly watches you at a distance or you watches this person this person can live at a distance from you but really this person somebody is waiting and watching waiting to speak some type of truth or something like that you know that could be another part of the truth as well you know there's st several storylines i'm seeing Somebody could want to tell someone that they've always viewed them as a soulmate, but the other person could have left the situation already because you were tired of waiting. You know, you could be in an energy where you're, you're wanting a new life now. You're tired of waiting around for this person with a TikTok card being here. You're tired of waiting for this person to give you what it is that you deserve. Go ahead and clarify some cards for me, Spirit. Yeah, this person wasn't giving you the commitment that you were looking for with the Hierophant. They wasn't giving you um, this commitment. This person could have possibly been inconsistent. I feel as though they watched you from a distance, but they wouldn't say anything to you. Or you could have just been observing this person's behavior. This person wasn't giving you an offer um, as well. They were slow to give an offer. You know, I just feel like the person you're dealing with is dealing with a lot of mental conflict as well. And because of all the mental conflict that they have, you're losing passion for this connection. You've lost a lot of passion for this person as well. But, you know, with this new life card being here and the Ace of Pentacles being here under the deck, I really feel like this, this, is, this is the gift that Spirit is bringing you. A new life, new opportunity, new love will be coming into your life once you make a decision to possibly cut off someone who was non-committal. Yeah, I feel like you wasn't getting any wish fulfillment in this situation. You wasn't getting any wish fulfillment and you're tired of being in the Ten of Swords energy. You know, you're not going to wait for this person to take these swords out of your back. You're, you're just going to do it yourself. You know, with the Three of Swords clarifying TikTok, 
This is letting me know that this person waited so long to the point where your heart was broken. You were heartbroken because this person took so long to give you the commitment that you deserve or to tell you anything. Like, it broke your heart that this person drugged their feet. You're no longer going to invest in this situation anymore. I, I really feel like you um, made a conscious decision to walk away from this situation because this person made you feel like... Um, I, it's like this person brought you to your lowest or you wasn't able to be the highest version of yourself because of this person. This person has you questioning a lot about yourself that you didn't have to. After Ten of Cups here under the deck, that's a good thing. So, you know, after you make this transition, after you walk away from this connection, you're going to walk right into the Ten of Cups. The Ten of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles. With the round and round card being here as well, this is letting me know that this was some type of karmic cycle that you were going through with this person. And also, change in the wind is right behind that. This is letting me know that you've changed your mind. You you changed your mind. You, you don't want to wait on this person. You're tired of being in conflict with this person. And you're done sitting around waiting. You're no longer going to wait. You're no longer going to wait. Because I just feel like you waited for a while and this person drove their feet. Yeah. Six of Cups in reverse, this person, you know, in an upright, this means someone from your past returning. This person, I really don't feel like this person had any intention on giving you what it is that you deserve. This person only came around when it was convenient. But here you are deciding that you're actually going to sleep at night. You know, because in the upright, this is this is an energy of anxiety. You can't sleep overthinking the situation. But the fact that it's here in the reverse, you're no longer doing that either. Like, you're actually on your way towards a new life, new love, new opportunity. Someone could have some type of drinking addiction as well. Or these could just be all the emotions that you kept, that you hold near and dear for this person. But just because, you know, you love someone, you don't have to um, continue to stick around. Especially if this person isn't giving you what it is that you deserve. The lover's card being here, you guys wasn't seeing eye to eye. You never knew where you stood with this person. So you decided to go ahead and work on your money, work on your finances, become the queen of pentacles. Um, or shit, you could already be the queen of pentacles. Some of y'all have new um, opportunities that's going to be coming your way, you know, with this new life card being here once you walk away from this toxic connection. And that's the truth. To me, the Ace of Swords always represents truth. When truth is being said, are you just knowing the truth? Your intuition has always been guiding you on the truth as well. I have the, the Queen of Wands and the Magician. You guys are manifesting something that's full of passion. Like, this new love that's coming into your life is going to bring you a lot of passion and avenues that you never, you know, you never would have thought of before. Or just, you're going to get to experience something new, you know, something passionate. You know, I really feel like a lot of you guys, you just never really knew where you stood in, in this connection with this person. So, because you didn't know where you stood, you just decided to work on yourself. I'm hearing some of you guys could have started a bakery or something like that. Or some of you guys bake for a living or you're good at baking or cooking or something like that. Painting. Okay, Spirit, go ahead and clarify. Well, not clarify, but go ahead and give me some... Um, some messages for cancer what is like the most important messages that cancer needs to hear disruption but disruption came out in the reverse so you're not going to allow this situation to disrupt your life anymore no this you're not going to allow this to make you feel like you're in pieces anymore you're going to pick yourself back up piece yourself back together and you're going towards this new opportunity you're not going to allow this to disrupt you you're not going to give into temptation either right you're gonna i feel like you've been patient for a while anyway and now it's your payout now a spirit actually giving you the big payout that you deserve suffering in silence you've definitely been suffering in silence for a long time and now you're breaking free you're breaking away from that because you know what it is that you deserve, right? And the most important, the overall message is patience and planning. So you you have patience twice. Patience and planning and patience. So Spirit is saying, you know, continue to be patient. And just know that this new love, this new life, this Ten of Cups, this Ace of Pentacles will be coming your way. All because you're making the conscious decision to tell the truth. 
and walk away from some situation because you said it's time to go or to, to truth be told car could be you just being truth with yourself being truthful with yourself right okay all right i love you guys so much thank you so much for subscribing to my channel if you have not already done so go ahead and subscribe go ahead and hit the bell so that when i make a, a post you will definitely go ahead and get an alert i love you guys so much as usual in peace